Configuring the Production View HD is a simple process. In this video, we will provide a sample configuration with four PTZ cameras, a Sony BRC-H700 and a Panasonic AWHE100, both at 1080i resolution, a Sony EVI-HD1 at 720p, and a Sony BRC-300 with 480i S-Video, all using Badio's Quick Connect CCUs. The additional devices are a DVD player at 480i, and a laptop with a resolution of 1280 by 768. All of the video resolutions can be seamlessly processed by Production View HD and up converted or down converted to analog RGB, standard definition, or component high definition. For our demonstration, the output resolution on both program and preview will be configured for 1080i. The first step is to connect all of your video inputs and outputs. Production View HD uses standard 15 pin VGA connectors making connectivity simple and easy. For component HD video, Vadio offers two 15-pin to component video adapter cables in either 3-foot or 6-foot lengths. For standard definition video, a 1-foot video breakout cable for composite or YC of video is available as well. If Vadio Quick Connect CCUs are used with the system, connect wiring from the tally outputs on Production View HD to the back of the CCUs. This is done by simply connecting the positive and ground to the tally port on the CCU and the other ends to Production View HD for each CCU unit. After connecting all of the inputs and outputs, power up the system. After initializing, a menu will appear on the screen. Arrow down to the Video Output option and then select Program Output. A menu will appear that shows all of the resolution output options. For our setup, we have chosen 1080i Video. Once the output is found, press Select, then press Cancel to exit out. Repeat the process for Preview Out. Next, arrow down to the Video Input menu. There is an option to set up all ports to the same configuration, in those cases where all input signals have the same resolution, or select each camera individually. A menu will appear that shows all of the resolution input options. Set each input port for the appropriate video resolution for the device connected. After programming the inputs and outputs, save the configuration. Next, power Production View HD down and then power it back up. As the system initializes, each of the PTZ cameras and video inputs will be recognized by the system. Now, the system is ready for operation.